Today's interview is brought to you by Northern Non Bakery and Faster Booze, proud sponsors of Katie Barrows Fallen. If you'd like to sponsor a player at Tramway Rovers women's team, don't forget you can contact below with the with the email address below at hannahn at tramwayrovers.co.uk for more details. Hello and welcome to Tramway Rovers YouTube channel and another edition of the Get It To Know You series. This week I'm joined by Katie Bowers Fowler, our fast pacey winger. And we're going to get to know a bit more about Katie. Katie, thanks for joining us today. No worries. And we're going to get to know a bit more about you. So, first question first, what's your pre-match routine? Ooh, pre-match routine, I love this. To be honest, I stick by it every, every week. Um, tend to get up quite handy and then I'll obviously go down, make some breakfast, which is usually oats, um, with like peanut butter, chai seeds, a bit of fruit, um, and then I tend to have obviously like a cup of tea or a coffee or whatever I feel like, with loads of water obviously. Um, and then I, I like to have a bath, like oh, yeah. before the game to relax my muscles and then have a little stretch out afterwards. Um, it's just something I've always like stood by. Um, and then obviously get ready, do the hair, um, <laughs> And then yeah, good to go. Energy crew. Yeah. All energy. Energy is ready when I've done that routine. Yeah. Buzzing. I know. Love it. So what's your go-to karaoke song then? Um. I remember the other day we had this discussion, didn't we? <laughs> uh, you got a couple. Yeah. Well, the main one has got to be Valerie by Amy Winehouse. That is an absolute banger, to be honest. Um. But then second, me and Ellie, obviously in football training, are always singing it. It'd be High School Musical, weirdly. You know, it's hard to believe that I couldn't see that one. Yeah. That you'll always rap beside me. <laughs> that one, isn't <yeah. laughs> That one, that yeah. one. Yeah, yeah, Belter. That, that's Belter. It is. Well, it gets everyone singing. It's quite yeah. up, innit? Isn't it? Isn't it? Up, upbeat. It's a bit, like, bit, bit like Breaking Free, is it, as well? That one, yeah. <laughs> yeah. God, you're a High School Musical fan. <laughs> I was forced to watch it a lot when I was young, but I've <laughs> got an older sister, so it's, yeah. Yeah, but honestly, the best. best. Back in the day, they weren't bad films. I know, I know, they were Timeless. Yeah. So, on the next one is, what's your favourite meal? To be honest, this is quite hard for me, because I'm a proper foodie. Um, I'd probably say Italian food, like, any Italian food, like give me all the carbs, like bread, pasta, yeah, I'm here for it. But I'd probably say pasta with garlic bread, but I couldn't exactly tell you what pasta, because I like carbonara and I like a tomato pasta and I like a rissa pasta, so I can't exactly put my finger on it, but it's got to be pasta and garlic bread probably, that's or pizza. That's <laughs> nice. Um, you're vegan as well, which you, I know yeah. you won't mind me saying, so obviously that's one of the dishes that you can can have, I'm guessing, is it? Yeah. Uh, not much needs to be changed in the, in the dishes. Yeah, I just obviously can't have like fresh pasta because it's like made obviously differently, but um, yeah, I like it. I like it. I like um, pasta and garlic bread. So yeah. Oh, gotta love garlic bread. Taste sensation, as Peter K would say. Yeah, it is. Garlic bread. Red with garlic done. <laughs> <laughs> So what's your favourite boots? Um, this is quite hard to be honest because when I was younger I always loved like Adidas Predators and they were like my go-to but then obviously I'm partial to Nike but Nike have been my favourites for the past two years. Um, probably Tiempos or Phantoms at the minute I've got two pairs of Phantoms and I love them like they're just dead comfy like the soft ones are oh, they're, they're my favourites to be fair. I noticed you were rocking new boots the other day, nice gold pair. Yeah, a little pair of phantoms, they're brand new then, straight out the box. <laughs> Cheeky Christmas present or? Indeed, yeah, yeah, love them. Gotta love that. This is always a difficult one. You're on a desert island and you've got to have two mates, teammates stuck with you on that island. Who are you picking and why? Oh, th this is actually really hard to be honest because I'd probably want to take like majority of the, well actually all the team because everyone would bring something different. But I'm probably going to say Penno, just because she's she's just funny, like funny, and she just bring a lot of entertainment to it. Um, but then also I'd probably say Katie, 
because she's a driving instructor, good with directions, I'm guessing. So she could probably help us around the desert island and like try and get off it potentially. Um, and then Penno would just bring the entertainment value because Penno is probably on the same wavelength as me. Um, so I feel like we just cause chaos and Katie would have to try and get us off this island potentially. So they're probably the two would go with. But then I feel like everyone else would still bring something. Like I could go on all all after, well, all evening to be honest and tell you many more people would have bring and why. <laughs> That's a really good answers to be fair. A lot of people have said Penno, uh, and we've had a few different reasons for Penno, like, and a few have said, because she watches all these random YouTube videos and TikToks oh and stuff, God, yeah. said that she'll come out with some like random fact that will save you, and, yeah. and help you, like, how to build a raft or something, Yeah. or um, what food you can eat. And, and to be honest, she's quite good with making videos, so if we had a phone with us, there'd be really good content. But yeah. the problem is Wi-Fi. Yeah, but you'd still have videos, wouldn't you? I suppose, yeah, and you can watch and them back. And then you could, and... you know, when you're finally on dry land, and pro well, it's obviously your dry land because it's a desert, but you know what I mean, yeah. when you're on actual land, you'd be, you'd be fine because you'd have it all, the footage. Bear girls eat your heart out. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, literally. <laughs> Now on to the quick fire round, we'll ask you a few questions and you answer as quick as you like really. Okay. So would you rather watch a film or binge watch a TV show? Ooh. Depends on film though. Um, but I'm partial to a little binge watch of something. I don't really like watching films that much but I'd probably go with a little binge watch of something. So yeah, binge watch. Solo goal or a team move? Oh, I don't know, you know, because a team move is quite tasty, isn't it? Um, but also, solo goal is quite a nice feeling. But I'd probably go with a, a team move, yeah. Are you a LucasAid, Powerade or Gatorade fan? LucasAid. Ah, LucasAid. Got a bottled stuff camera there. Gingerbread or shortbread? Always difficult because they're both, both quite nice. I'm going to say shh, oh, gingerbread. Gingerbread? Yeah, gingerbread. Good for the stomach as well. Yeah, gingerbread. Summer ball or winter ball? Um, summer. Spending all your life as a kid or all your life as an adult? All your life as a kid, all day. Absolutely. Live the dream as a kid. <laughs> you won't be able to drive though. Yeah, but you're still living the dream, aren't you? I suppose you get away with a lot as a kid, don't you? Yeah, exactly. Imagine me as a kid again. I'd be causing absolute chaos. <laughs> <laughs> the big ones, Sam Craig, Lynn or Harry? I'm not answering that. Absolutely not. Go can't. on. No, I can't. Turning the screw. Go I on. can't. I can't answer that. No chance. Oh, disappointment. No chance. All of them together. Cock end <laughs> or the cow shed? Cop end, obviously, but I feel like it's quite more, f it's like fun, isn't it, when you go the other end, because it's like the rivals of human, you know what I mean? <laughs> but yeah, cop end, all day. So this has been another episode of the Getting to Know You series. Thanks for, Ka for Katie for joining us today. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe to the channel, and we'll see you all very soon. Bye! <laughs>